Hello, this is Andrew Ford, and today we're going to look at what to do when your effects are cut off on your layer. Here we have a logo on the background. When we go to apply an effect, such as trap code shine, you'll see that the rays do not go beyond the boundaries of the layer. Let me change the color here in the shine so you can see this better. And you can see that the effect stops at the logo boundaries because the layer is just ending where the logo ends. It's not respecting the entire alpha channel of the comp. There are two main ways that this can be solved. The first way is with a handy effect called Grow Bounds. Go to your effects menu, down to Red Giant and RGS Grow Bounds. And here you can expand the pixel boundary of your layer. However, right now it is below the shine effect on our effects control, so nothing we're going to do is going to show. What you have to do is move it to the top of the effects panel over the shine effect. And now you see as we expand the boundary, the effect is no longer limited by the prior constraints. A second way to fix this issue is simply to pre-compose your layer with the logo. So highlight the layer, go to Layer Pre-Compose, move all attributes, hit OK, and now you can simply add the Trap Code Shine effect onto the layer. As you can see, the layer boundaries are now at the edges of the composition. And so when we add the Trap Code Shine effect, the effect takes over the full screen and is not cropped like before. So those are two good ways to fix this issue. Thank you.